Cam, for you, your twin, to watch him go off like that, what was it like to see him on the core golf for a new career high? It was crazy. He was in the zone um, and, you know, making plays, getting buckets all type of ways. It was great to see. And it seemed like that there's like a little different type of play from that first half versus that second half. Yeah. What changed? What was the difference maker? Uh, we just starting to get settled in. That's all it is. We just starting to get settled in, get more comfortable with each other. Um, and we have somebody, you know, have a performance like Mikhail did tonight. It helps a lot. And what does it mean to get that first win before the All-Star break? It feels like right time, right place. It's all about momentum and peaking at the right time. Um, you know, just continuing to chip away each and every day, uh, get better, um, and learn to be more cohesive as a group. And I think we made strides in that today. When, when he's got it going like that, do you say anything to him? Do you go? I tell him keep going. I tell him keep going. Um, I tell him keep going. You know, this early in the season, he had so many moments where he just had to go get it. He just had to, you know, handle a lot more responsibility. Um, a lot of guys were injured, and he really stepped up. And you know, all that all that experience. Um, you know, culminated in, in this performance today. And, and when that time came, he was ready for it. And, you know, that's what I'm proud of him for it. I, I was going to say, you know, obviously you saw him take on a yep. higher offensive load in, in Phoenix yep. and with Devin now. Right. Was he showcasing new stuff? Is this stuff yeah. he's always been able to do? He's always been able to do it, but he's been honing it. Uh, we've been in the, we were in the gym all summer, and every single day he's in there honing this stuff, getting better, putting the work in every day in practice, you know, for the past couple of years, putting the work in. And people, you know, used to ask him, us all the time, um, you know, what is it that you're working on? What are you trying to add to your game? And and I tell him, he tell him, it's you know, we might have a specific role on the court uh, the past couple of years, but we work on our game completely off, and uh, you know, we'll get the chance to show it. And, and when he gets the chance to show it, he's he's really stepping up. And that circus layup that you made, have you choreographed it that way before? Or was that kind of going going at going with the flow? Um, he kind of stepped up and took away my right hand, so I just turned. Um, I got to look at the hoop before I jumped and just hope for the best. <laughs> I made up for the dunk, though, you know? It's like... Yeah. Uh, Cam, for this group, Jack kind of joked that he wished you guys could practice during the All-Star break so you guys could get to know each other a little bit more and get some practice time in. But for you to get traded a week ago and now have this break, what will the All-Star break look like for you? I'm going back to Phoenix. Uh, I miss my dog. I don't have her with me, and she's my... She's my uh, life source. She, she recharges me. Um, and, and so I'll get to see her. I'll get to see my family. Um, and then get to packing, um, get things tidied up, and get the things out here that I need out here. But I'm, I'm excited for it. Um, but I'm good. I'm ready to go. You know, I missed a little bit of time this year, so I'm, I'm really just starting to get back into a rhythm, get back into full game shape. You know, I've been back uh, 12 games now, 11, 12 games. So, you know, I feel like I can just keep on going. But, uh, you know, I'm going to enjoy this break. I'm going to continue to work, continue to get better, and look forward to uh, this last 20, 25 games. You guys hit a lot of threes. You guys played good defense. You had Mikel looking like a star. Yeah. Is this kind of the blueprint to how this team can really come out? Yeah, and I think we can, we can even be better. Um, so many opportunities, I mean, so many, you know, instances where we can be better, um, better offensively, better defensively. So it just shows that I think this group is capable of a lot. It's a good, it's a good Miami team. Can you talk about the ball sticking a bit in the garden right. and getting second? I mean, you guys had six guys with three more assists tonight. Yeah. I think you're one of them too. Just what, what was working so well in that front? Uh, kind of try and touch the paint, um, seek threes, um, and, and, and continue to play with pace. You know, that first shift definitely got to my lungs a little bit, getting up and down. But um, you know, I think when we when we fill the corners, get our spacing, and come off actions, you know, violently, then. Uh, We'll find those opportunities, and we'll find the ball moving more. Can you talk a little bit about Mikhail? You know what he's had in his game that maybe yeah. people didn't see. What about for you that you feel like you're able to do here, maybe that you aren't able to showcase in the field? Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, ball in my hand more. Um, and I, I feel like I got a lot more to show. You know, I feel like I got a lot more to show. Um, coming off this All-Star break, I'm gonna go in, get back in the lab, and and tidy some things up. And you know, I'm really excited for this last bit because I feel like you know I'm really in a position now where. With Mikael, Spence, Dodo, Nick, uh, it's equal opportunity across the board. And I, I've seen so many opportunities past three games that I'm going to get back and just drill them out over, over break. What is that? Is that driving more? Is it more it's both, it's like everything. Balance? It's everything. And you guys see the threes. I mean, I had too many go in and out today, but tidy this stuff up and it's going to feel pretty good. What? I was like, man, what? I guess the, the layup dunk. You try to kill somebody. That's easy. You know, that's an easy one. So I, I'll get a couple of those. You guys will see. I, I, I might lay up a couple, but you'll see every once in a while I'll, I'll try to pull out some. 
uh, a little extra. Where are you going? Do your eyes light up when you see how many three-point opportunities you get in the Yeah, office? man, yeah. what? Light up. So it's on me to just take advantage of them. Question. Since this is your first time being traded, have you asked any veteran for advice for, you know, cross-country move and all that stuff? Yeah, I asked a lot of people. I talked to a lot of people. People have been in this position. People have been in the league for a long time. And the biggest advice I got is just worry about the basketball stuff first. Um, life, house, clothes, logistics. They'll take care of themselves. Um, and there's people, you know, around me to help me take care of all those things. But my job is to focus on the basketball. So uh, that's what I'll do. And, um, you know, I, I like I like this group. I like playing here. Um, and it's been pretty good so far. And I think, you know, the sky's the limit.